In line with international law, only the UN Security Council could sanction the use of force against the sovereign state. Any other pretext or method which might be used to justify the use of force against an independent sovereign state is inadmissible and can only be interpreted as an aggression. Yeah, but he's not really it out in general, uh, Katie Stallard there in St. Petersburg. A bit of a softening of his attitude or not? How are you reading this? I think that is the part that people will seize on to, this statement that Russia does not exclude supporting military action, or at least that it doesn't exclude not vetoing action through the UN Security Council. But if you look at what he then goes on to say, the level of evidence that he would need in order to do that, he says it would have to be a deep and scientific probe containing evidence that would be obvious and prove beyond doubt who did it and what means were used. Now, he can say that with complete security because he knows that that is not what the UN weapons team were there to determine. Their mandate was just to find out whether an attack took place and what sort of chemical weapons were used. They were not looking for evidence to apportion blame. So his statement can be made in the complete safety that that level of evidence will not be found. Meanwhile, he goes on to say that Russia will consider action by America on Syria to be an action of aggression. And he says that it's too early to talk about what, what Russia's response will be. But he says we have our ideas about what will happen should there be use of force or otherwise. He says, we have our plans.